turkey down, Zach. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's birthday present, Don. <laughs> I met the Corleys whenever I was about 11 or 12. I was at a uh, sensory safari. People gather up mounts of all different kinds, squirrels to hippopotamuses. It's for the visually impaired people to come and they can come and touch these mounts, which they would never have an opportunity to normally do. Basically, I went and set them up. I wasn't gonna get too involved in uh, the actual guiding of the Century Safari. And then the day that I met Zach, it completely changed my and Linda's life. And at that point, I had, I'd only been blind for a few years, and uh, thoughts through my head were, you know, they were ridiculous thoughts, such as, uh, I'm the only blind person, no one else is out there that, you know, has this situation. I was just feeling completely um, alone. So after I went the sensory safari, that, that at first helped me witness that, oh wow, you know, there's other blind people out like me interested in animals, interested in hunting. And then uh, when I expressed the interest in the bears, they said, well, meet, you know, you gotta meet Don Corley. His dream was to go bear hunting, and I told Linda after about the second or third time we'd met Zach, I said, uh, you're not gonna believe what we're gonna do, Linda, but we're gonna take Zach on a bear hunt. And she said, well, how are we gonna do that? And I said, well, I don't have any idea, but we'll figure that out. Ever since then, things have just, uh, like, just blossomed. I've been open to many opportunities, many doors were open for me. We, we were able to travel and hunt in Canada and South Africa. And he's very soft and big ears. Through that, I believe that opens and sparked my interest in uh, world travel. I now go to school at Texas A&M and I'm majoring in international studies with a, an emphasis in German. It's just kind of like one thing led to another. Uh, our relationship with Zach and his family, it just, it grew from a, a friendship to almost like they became part of our family and uh, actually we've got more out of it probably than Zach. You can do whatever you want to do as long as you put your mind to it. We appreciate things a lot more now that we didn't used to, and uh, everybody's got the same story. They think they don't have the time to do something like this, but uh, once you get into it, you just make the time. It's, uh, it's, a, it's a very rewarding thing to get involved in. Ever since meeting the Corleys, everything has just uh, fallen into place. We started off at Century Safaris, then we uh, met another couple of little boys, Austin and Garrett, and then uh, it, it's a story that's got a beginning that there's probably no end. It's just, it's, uh, it, it's gonna be a continuation of uh, men involved with this, this group, that, another group, and uh, you know, you never know where it's gonna go. Yeah, I just tried, I was using a pistol grip and my arm was locked out. Cause I'm reaching over Don's shoulder going, almost there. <laughs> 